For those of you who are out of the loop, Apple have released, um, well, not in necessarily released, it won't be out till June 19th, but they have announced the iPhone 3GS. Now, technically, the 3GS, the S stands for speed, and that makes sense because the iPhone's processor is a lot faster, but I'm calling it the 3G Speaks. And the reason is because they've actually done a beautiful thing with it in terms of accessibility. They have taken the Zoom utility and voiceover straight from the Mac and ported it to the iPhone. And not only that, um, it is standard equipment, but they have made it such that you don't even need a keyboard to operate it. What's interesting about this screen reader is that it's a gesture-based screen reader. Now, I went through a, real, a rather lengthy email the other night possibly from Apple's website. Um, it was uh, forwarded to the National Association of Blind Students list that I'm, a, that I'm on. Um, what they said was um, it's a, it is a gesture-based screen reader. It supports a whole variety of languages. Um, and it's, 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 it's interesting. Um, you can do like a single tap to see what's on the screen, a double tap to open what's like an icon, like an application, for instance. Um, if you want to just adjust the voiceover preferences, the, uh, at least I think it was the voiceover preferences, they have this uh, rotary dial deal where you just turn your hand like this, and that'll adjust your preferences, um, I think. That email was so lengthy that I don't remember everything that was said. Um, but... This, I think, blows mobile speak out of the water because just like OS X on the Mac, um, this is built into the operating system. It comes free of charge, which means if you're willing to go with the 16-gig uh, iPhone, you can have full accessibility out of the pocket for $199 on contract. Okay? And that includes because, okay, let's, 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 let's look at this here. Samsung Saga. 299 okay now this is a Windows mobile device on Verizon and it's the one that I would personally get where I to get a Windows mobile device so I'm gonna use that for an example all right so uh, 300 on contract for the saga right 250 for the magnifier so that's 550 plus an additional three or four hundred for the screen reader so that's almost a thousand dollars for accessibility for full accessibility to match the iPhone and the iPhone's giving you a screen reader and a magnifier full out of the box complete accessibility to the iPhone through gestures for $199 on contract uh, $299 if you want the 32 gig model and um, I just think this is fantastic this is again the same technology that's on the Mac because the iPhone does run OS 10 um, the one thing I'm curious about, though, is whether or not this technology will be ported to iPhone OS 3.0. Now, iPhone OS 3.0 will come preloaded on the iPhone 3GS, but I have a first-generation iPod Touch, and I'm curious as to whether or not I'll be able to use that just to see what it's like. But this technology, full out-of-the-box accessibility for $199 on contract, that is more than enough to make me swing over to AT&T. Um, but, you know, once I manage to see it in person, then I'll be able to make my final judgment. But just the idea of having a full out-of-the-box screen reader for the iPhone, plus the voice control, um, you just hold down the home button and you yak into it and it does, you know, whatever, whatever you tell it to do. Um, you get the voiceover control, you get, you get, excuse me, you get voice control, you get voiceover, the screen reader, you get a full magnifier, um, I, I, it just doesn't get any better than that, if you ask me. I mean, like I said, for $199 on contract, full accessibility out of the box, and you don't even need an external keyboard for this. Again, it's it's just it's gesture based. Um, excuse me. And um, you know, it it was interesting. If anybody wants to, I can forward the email to them that I got on the NABS list. I still have it. Um, it's in my it's in my NABS folder, uh, National Association of Blind Students list folder. Um, so if anybody wants me to forward them that email, I can. But 
I mean, a lot of people say, you know, voice control, uh, GPS, compass, um, a lot of the stuff that, oh, and the three megapixel camera. A lot of people say, uh, well, particularly with the voice control, a lot of people say, oh, we've had that, a lot of other phones have had that for some time. What they have never had is full out of the box accessibility on a level where every last thing is accessible and you don't need any external accessories to do it. This, um, I do believe the iPhone has the ability to edit office documents, or actually read office documents, I'm sorry, I don't know if it can edit them. I don't know if there's an application out there for that, but if there is, um, if there is an application that can do that, and the iPhone would be able to accept, say, a Bluetooth keyboard from this application, um, and full screen reader access, this could definitely give our note takers a run for the money because, um, full accessibility out of the box for, if you get, let's, let's say there was a keyboard, okay? I'm not saying there is, let's just say that there was, just for sake of argument. So let's say there was a keyboard, and you get the keyboard, it's, uh, say, a hundred bucks, okay? So that's still, I mean, $300 for a full-blown accessible note-taker out of the box versus 2000 for, you know, our specialized equipment. This is absolutely phenomenal, if you ask me. Oh, there was one more thing, and I don't remember what it is. Shoot, um... Oh, um, the iPhone, if you do not want the I, the 3GS, they have lowered the price of the iPhone 3G. It is now $99. Um, that's the 8 gigabyte model iPhone 3G. Once you get into the 16 and 32 gig models, you're in the iPhone 3GS territory. Um, so, uh, that's pretty much it. If there's anything I forgot, uh, please read the description. I'll probably have that in there. So, um, yeah. Thank you for watching. Comments are welcome, and have a nice day.